Manchester area, and while authorities and relief workers from Monarch are redoubling their efforts, it seems everybody's working at capacity. And Time was broken, working out of sync. The city was in a state of chaos. The end of time was closing in. And you still believed you could fix it? The solution was inside Monarch Tower. The countermeasure. The CFR, as Monarch knew it. The key to the lifeboat protocol. Monarch's survival plan. But that didn't seem to matter to you. I had a better plan. <sighs> okay, then. Welcome, Welcome to the International, International Headquarters, Headquarters of Monarch, Monarch Solutions. Solutions. This state-of-the-art building has become world famous for its unique architecture and its iconic presence in the Riverport skyline. Incorporating an unprecedented level of automation designed with both comfort and security in mind, complete with a zero carbon footprint. The building provides a safe and environmentally friendly workplace for thousands of Monarch Mr. Hatch! Uh, I thought you... They all we think about is they are confused about the zero carbon footprint. Well, in that case, I'm sure you're all cool. Poor bastard doesn't know anything about the train crash. Hope he doesn't have a heart attack when time resumes. Welcome, Welcome to the International Headquarters, headquarters of Monarch. Of this state-of-the-art building has become world famous for its unique architecture and 
iconic presence in the Pinterest skyline. Incorporated a president level automation designed to make the I was getting closer to the countermeasure. Paul had the key to fixing the fracture all along, but he didn't see it. There was nothing to see. He believed the fracture couldn't be fixed. That's why he used the countermeasure, the CFR, to create the lifeboat. Those men died fighting something that lives outside of time. The very reason our weapons program was built. Serene knew they were coming. Weapons weren't doing the trick. Fiona, can you get the door open for me? I think so. Sorry, this isn't quite my forte. I know a guy who would do this in his sleep, and he's about as dependable as... Oh, never mind, that's it.
Dr. Amaral was the key to Paul's survival. So why was she killed? Serene believed she was working against him, wanted him dead. I wonder who made him think that. The Monarch PR machine was going strong. The public believed that they were doing what the police force couldn't, protecting them from a terrorist threat. From you. scrambling. Paul's empire was falling apart all around me. I'd never seen anything like it. But Paul had. That's what he was preparing for all those years. He didn't do a very good job. What the fuck was that thing? The train. All personnel, stay clear of the lower levels. There's a possible hazard. Repeat, stay clear of the lower levels. There appears to be a train crashed into the building. The situation is under control. Another door I need help with, Fiona. You're at Serene's office, good. Uh, just a second, this one's a little tricky. Serene's got access to the CFR chamber, and there's going to be a pretty dangerous guy there guarding. <laughs> got it. Just be careful, okay? Paul was already gone, but he left behind the one thing I needed. We have a we mission. Have a mission. Prep, the, Prep chopper. the chopper. Ready to lift off in 15, 15, sir. What's, What's the profile? Full tactical, tactical complement. And we're going to need a tech squad for assembly. 
I'll brief them on the way. Copy that. Copy that. Good hunting. Good hunting. Sir. My office alarm went off. Is that you skulking around, Jack? Fuck you. I'm done playing games. I'm here for what you stole. Yes, of course. The CFR. If you understood just how much depended on that, you'd leave it alone. But I know you don't care. You're right. I don't. And it looks like you're not here to stop me. Yes. Yes, everything will play out as it has to play out. I'll see you very soon, Jack. I'm done dancing your tune, you crazy bastard. The countermeasure was Paul's prize. Everything he'd built was based on Will's device. His plan depended on it. You better believe I look forward to taking it from him. Paul spent a long time running Monarch in secret. It probably didn't help with that whole disconnected from reality thing. Paul told me that he tried to change things. It failed. What he'd seen, it broke him. And I'd seen Beth go down the same path, but Paul... It consumed him. 17 years, he lived through twice. All of it mapped out, from memory. He knew the market trends before they occurred. He had the tools to make a fortune, and he did. Dr. Amaral was the one thing keeping Paul alive, but reading through their exchanges, there was something more than professional going on. That's not my place to comment on. Paul was a powerful man, the leader of an empire, but behind the veil, he was a dying man. The signs were clear.
They'd stockpiled all the chronon particles from Ground Zero to keep the lifeboat running. Enough to hopefully last until a proper solution was discovered. Seeing that face put it into perspective. They were all misled. The lifeboat revolved Manipulated to believing they were doing what was right. He knew Will would try to take it back. That's why he was killed. Liam Burke made his choice. He knew I'd try to do the Liam same Liam Burke eventually. was an Clearly unnecessary was casualty. Right. One of way too many. Fiona, I'm at the CFR chamber. Door's locked. That's way above my access level. But since my friend disabled security earlier, I should be able to do this. Listen, I don't really know what the plan is, but it's all up to you now. Good luck. It was like walking into a shrine. There'd been some kind of struggle in the chamber. This was our holy relic. I didn't know the details. Somebody cleaned it up. A man named Charlie Wincott. I believe he chose to take a stand. Unfortunately, it ended badly for him. Mm-hmm. Well, it seems to be that kind of work environment. It took 11 years for Will to build the countermeasure. Beth died for it, and I knew it could fix the fracture. This fucking thing. Problem was, I didn't have a clue how to use it. The only person who did was dead. But Monarch had a way of getting to him before that ever happened. The university time machine. They've got the core here. Monarch had built their own time machine above the CFR chamber. That's where I needed to go. You still believed you could go back and save your brother? Yes. Paul took the core of the time machine from the university, hooked it up to his own machine. It was part of his sick desire for control, but that gave me one last shot at fixing things. I could go back, maybe get to Will before Paul killed him. And if I could get the countermeasure in Will's hands, maybe I could still turn everything around. The core was set, the machine was prepped. I had to put the core door in place. Okay, this should do it.
was ready. I just needed to put in the date. The earliest I could go back to was the time that the Corps was first activated. At the University. Not much time to rest.
got an intruder in the lab. Core extraction team is down. Over. All of them. How? Joyce's. Moving in. Open fire. I got there after the fracture initiated. Too late to stop it all before it ever started. But not too late to save Will. All you had to do was get to him in time. Yeah, that was the plan. HQ, we've got security footage of the Joyce brothers escaping through the server room on the lower level. Raider Team 3, intercept immediately. Ready another extraction unit to remove the core. Prowler team, ready the heavies in the underground parking. I'm not hearing any response from Raider Team 3. We may have a situation. Where the Duffy. hell is that extraction team? We were supposed to have the core loaded in that chopper by now. Hatch was right. Should have sent Liam Burke in first to deal with those Joyce assholes. Directive was take a live... <laughs> I remember that Will and I were heading to the courtyard when the stutter hit. That's where I needed to cut him off. You never tried to stop Monarch from extracting the core. The fact that they stole it was the only reason I was able to return to the past. It's not a logic I wanted to mess around with.
to escape from the lab after the experiment. It seemed like Monarch was dealing with somebody other than us. That was me, all along. HQ, Striker Team is his choice! Raider 9, what do you mean Striker Team is down? How many? Civilians heard gunfire in the physics building. Got around with the witnesses. How come you get all the fun? Probably because I'm not rocking those ugly astronaut pants. Neighbor of the beast, you know? All right. 665. Okay. Get your team prepped for combat. Strikers. He's obviously not alone. My bet is there's at least five of them working together. So keep your eyes peeled.
gotta get to the library. No time to lose. I gotta get to Will. Shit. Too late. I gotta beat him to the library. I got orders, I got orders to, patrol to patrol the rooftops. We already, we already got, got them. Search the area. Gotta get to the library. If Joyce is in the <laughs> library, then who they'd spot him? Hostile, fuck!
Gotta get down there. Stand by to detonate the library. I'm going in. <sighs> Fuck. Well, already gone. Lobby. Lobby. I'm running out of time. Why? Why? Who is she? Who is she? she knows she about knows the fracture. About fracture. Well, there is. That's why I can't risk you opposing me, Will. It doesn't have to end like this. We can't just let this happen. Wasn't fixed. Not yet. Does it work? Theory, yes. We gotta get back to my time machine. We gotta get us back to the time where you came from. No, future. No, 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 no. It's the only we way. We need to stop the fracture here, in this time. Now. Oh, Jack, listen to me. The fracture wasn't fixed in the time where you came from. So fixing it here, it's always gonna fail. People are going to die, Will. You haven't seen what happens between now and then. No, but you have. What you have done has set in motion a chain of events that cannot be broken. Look, we don't know And if it could be broken, it could jeopardize the entire world. If we get one shot at this, there's too much at stake, Jack. Look, I know the stakes, okay? Then you gotta let go, Jack. Everything you have done to get to this place is necessary. Trust me. The past is set, but the future is. This way. If what you said is true, then how did I save you? I saw you die, Will. Think, Jack. You never physically saw me die, did you? I watched a roof collapse on top of you. Creating the illusion of my death, yes. Which brought you here to make sure it remained only an illusion. It's all a loop. If time is an egg, No then... egg metaphors. Get out of here and get to the Bradbury. Oh, get down over here. Goddamn bloodbath in there. I need some air. Cleaners better get here quick. Wait, 
wait for them to leave. Now, I know it's a lot to take in, but the fact that you managed to save me and yet still maintain the illusion of my death is actually further proof of my point. Risky the past eye. remains intact. Stick to the plan. Nothing changes, so and the Novikov self-consistency principle prevails. Oh, great. We can high-five about that later. Right. Let's save the world first. Come on. Let's meet up with the convoy. Okay, they're gone. Let's go. Surprised you actually waited. It's almost like you're listening to me. Well, the last time I didn't listen to you, the fracture occurred. Consider me open to following orders. Huh. That doesn't sound like my brother. I know. All right. Through here. Amy. We can't risk helping them. I know what happens if I don't. And it'll still happen, Jack. I meant what I said back there. And there are no exceptions. If you get suckered into trying to change what can't be changed, it may cost us everything. Please, Jack. Our future depends on this. You said Monarch had the countermeasure this whole time. How? Why? Paul was using it to fuel some kind of messed up survival program. <sighs> They must have somehow repurposed it as a localized Cronon field regulator. I always assumed it was Beth Wilder who had the countermeasure, keeping it safe. She was the one who warned me, told me to build it. I know. You met her. Is she helping us? She was. Ah, I see. Come on, this place. Oh shit, watch out. <laughs> well, hey. Call this way now. Look, I know I've kept you in the dark. But when I started my work, you were so young, and afterwards, I always hoped it would all pass you by without touching you. Yeah. I get it. Come on. Let's just go to the future and fix this mess.
Wait a second. There. It's locked. You hid the machine here. You really never used it yourself? No, I didn't dare. Not after the men came out. It was Paul. He tried to kill me. <clears throat> Damn. Rusted shut. Jack, a hand? One more time. When Monarch came for the time machine at the university, Paul was trapped in it. He escaped into the future. Whatever happened to him there changed him. Somehow he found my machine there and used it to come back to 1999. And found in Monarch. He escaped from Monarch and became what he escaped from. Insanity. I never should have built the machine. I should have left well enough alone. Just the way I left it. Hope it still works. Yeah. All right, we'll go to the future. A little after your time of departure, before the fracture has stopped time permanently. I don't know. I'm a little concerned about this. It'll be dangerous. Of course it'll be dangerous. At this point, what isn't? But I have been curious to try this. Jack, when we exit, it'll be a little past the point you were at when you left to save me. That's our window, when we know it can work, but before time actually ends for good. It may not be much of a window. Monarch was sure it was imminent. Huh. Like they're experts. They kind of are. All they know they stole from me. You worry about your end, I'll worry about mine. All right, well. That works. This is amazing. All those years. I never imagined that it would be like this. Crap. Hang on. Bro. Time's about to stop for good. Yes, it is. Hence the lifeboat program. A bunch of desperate people sitting around in a bunker somewhere waiting for the inevitable? Jesus, Paul. You stole the CFR, Jack. I stole it? And the plan depends on it. So... 
I'll take that back now, please. I can't do that. I know. Never mind. Tell me later. We got work to do. I'll have to hook up the countermeasure to the core. It's designed to hypersaturate the Maya Joyce field with proton particles. The time machine's like an amplifier. That'll cause a chain reaction and rejuvenate the field. It'll be a universal event. I'll take your word for it. Just make it happen.
What do you need? The counter mesh's charge is low. We'll need a jolt of chronon particles. A jump start. That's you. Countermeasure. It stitched time back together everywhere. <coughs> the destruction couldn't be undone. The lies we lost were real. But we fixed it. Jack. <sighs> Will. Clocks kept on ticking. Come on. Come on. <sighs> I think we just saved the universe. Yeah. There's Paul. He's dead. It's gone. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Will, he was wrong about everything. Was he? Will. The countermeasure worked. Whoa. The countermeasure burned out. Should be stable now. Of course, I'll have to run a few tests to confirm. But this well, there's no reason to believe that the fracture isn't over. One more question. Paul Serene's entire philosophy was that time is a set path, and nothing can be changed. At the time, you obviously disagreed. But after everything you've seen and done, we need to know. What do you believe now? Was he right? Or is it possible to change things? I'll come back for you.
You've been very patient with us and very helpful. Thank you. Yeah, well, that patience is starting to wear pretty thin. Of course. Right outside. Mr. Joyce. Finally. Thought you wanted to talk, not get my life story. Well, you were at the heart of all of this. And you can understand our need to find out exactly what happened. I heard it's all being pinned on Paul. It's quite the feat. Paul Serene always danced to his own tune, you know that. He and his delusions did tremendous damage to Monarch. But we can still salvage this company. We could use a man like you. It's not the same monarch you know, Mr. Joyce. Your exceptional qualities are obvious. And we both know you have certain needs our expertise could help with. We can help each other. 